Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Captain Aaron Stanton was born on August 14th in 1840 at a house called Traveler's Rest. He was known to family and friends, however, as Tip, a name he got from a grandfather who was also called Tip after he fought in the Battle of Tippy Canoe. His great-grandfather, Joseph Winston, was known as one of the heroes of Kings Mountain for his service at that battle during the Revolutionary War. Growing up in a family with a strong military tradition, it was only natural that Stanton volunteered for service when Mississippi seceded from the Union. During the Civil War, Stanton served in the Breckinridge Guards and was described as the finest horseman in the Army of Tennessee. Stanton made a name for himself on the field of battle at Missionary Ridge when he avoided capture by lying low in the saddle as bullets whizzed by him. He delivered his orders, reputedly saving an entire brigade from capture. Stanton was in the thick of the fight at the bloody Battle of Franklin, Tennessee, recognized for his composure even though his commander, General Patrick Cleburne, was killed by his side. After the war, Stanton married Ella Brandon, the granddaughter of Gerard C. Brandon, who twice served as governor of Mississippi. Erin and Ella lived at her family's home, Brandon Hall. Continuing the family tradition, Stanton's grandson was Aaron Tip Merrill, a rear admiral with the United States Navy. Stanton died in 1918. I'm Katie Winston Wood Freiberger, daughter of Bucci Wood, a naval pilot, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.